Whether you are a beginner or an experienced videographer, Femora 12 has a wide range of tools to help you achieve the perfect balance of color and tones for your videos. Hi everyone, this is Chloe from Wondershare Femora here to empower your inner video creator. Let's look at both the basic and advanced color correction tool available in Femora 12. If you haven't already downloaded Femora 12, Get started by going to filmartawanashare.com or clicking the link from the description. Now, let's explore the new color features. Open Filmart and import your video clip into the media library. Drag and drop your video clip into Filmart's timeline. Double click on the video clip you would like to color correct and go to the color tab. Here, we have three modes of color correction. Basic, HSL, and Curves. Let's start with Basic. Here, we can adjust white balance, color, light, vignette, and color match. Now, in the color tab, to adjust the overall exposure of the video, you can use the exposure slider. A positive value will lighten the color in the video, while a negative value will darken them. This is a great tool for fixing over or underexposed footage. Next, you can use the brightness slider to brighten or darken the overall tone of the video. The contrast slider allows you to adjust the difference between the darkest and lightest area of the image, making the darks darker and the lights lighter or vice versa. The Vibrance and Saturation slider let you adjust the intensity of the colors in the video. Vibrance targets less saturated colors and leave the more saturated ones alone, while Saturation targets all the colors in the image. Increase the sliders to make the colors more intense or decrease them to make the image look grayer. The White Balance tool is to help you neutralize any color cast in your footage. You can adjust the temperature slider to shift the overall color balance towards warmer or cooler tones and the tint slider to add tints of different hues to the image. You can try the auto function or use the eyedropper tool to select a white part of the clip to auto balance the color. In the vignette panel, you can apply a custom vignette effect to your video. A vignette is a gradual darkening or lightening of the edges of the frame. It can be really useful to draw attention to the center of the frame. To use the vignette tool, you can adjust amount, size, roundness, feather, exposure, and highlight slider. For example, you can use the amount slider to make the corners of the frame darker or lighter, the feather slider to control the sharpness of the vignette's edges, and the size slider to adjust the area of the frame affected by the vignette. All of this can be done directly to the video, or we can use the new adjustment layer feature. The adjustment layer will allow us to apply the same color onto multiple clips by adjusting the length of the layer. If you want to know more about adjustment layer in Filmora Top, you can find this tutorial on our channel. Now, let's move on to some of the advanced color correction tool in Filmora Top. Click on the histogram icon here. A histogram is a graphical representation of the tonal values in the videos, showing you the distribution of colors and their intensity. By analyzing the histogram of an image, you can adjust the levels or curves of the image to correct the overall exposure, increase the contrast, or bring out specific details in the image. It's a lot easier than trying to fix the color cast with your eyes. The light panel allows you to optimize the light in the video by adjusting the blacks, whites, shadows, and highlights. Drag the slider to the left or right to darken or lighten these areas of the image. HSL. The HSL panel allows you to adjust the hue, saturation, and luminance of specific color ranges in your video. Simply select a color from the color panel and then use the associated slider to fine tune the hue, saturation, and luminance of that color. This can be a helpful tool for making subtle adjustments to the color palettes of your video. Curves. Select the curves tool and you will see a fancy graph with a diagonal line. This line represents the current tonal values in your image. To adjust the contrast, just add some anchor points at the shadows and highlights and drag them upwards to compress the tonal values. Bam! Increase the contrast. Want to fix a color cast? Just add an anchor point to the curve of the channel that's causing the problem and drag it around until the color looks good to you. It's a good idea to analyze the histogram of the image before adjusting the RGB curves. 
as this can give you an idea of the overall tonal distribution in the image and help you to identify any color imbalances or exposure problems. There is a range of preset effects that can help you achieve the desired look for your video. These presets are organized into categories like Favorite, Custom, 3D LUT, Common, and Vignette. You can double click on a preset to apply it to your video and see how it looks in the preview window. If you find a preset that you particularly like, you can add it to your favorites for easy access later. So there you have it. These are the advanced color correction tools available in Filmora Top. Whether you're looking to fix basic exposure and color balance issues, or create a more stylized look for your videos, Filmora Top has you covered. So go ahead and give these features a try and let us know how it works. If you have already made videos based on these features, drop the links in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe for new videos on the channel. Keep creating and see you next time. Bye.